Hello guys, subscribe to the most interesting videos and press the bell icon to never miss another video. Life cycle of fern. The plant body of fern is divided into root, stem and leaves. Leaves are the only aerial part of plant body. Stem is represented by underground rhizome. Rhizome is densely clothed with numerous scales or ramenta. Leaves are large, compound and look like a branch, hence named as frond. Each leaf has a short stalk called petiole. The penny develop on main stalk called rachis, which is the continuous of petiole. Leaflet with sporangia unknown as sporophylls. Sporangium bears large number of spores. The sporangia are aggregated in groups called sori. The spore is minute dark brown and tetrahedral in shape. Prothallus is green and heart shaped. The prothallus lies flat on the ground and bears many unicellular rhizoids. On the undersurface, Antheridia and Archegonia are born. Antherozoids swim in water by their cilia. One of the sperm fuses with the egg to form a zygote. It covers itself with the cell wall and is called oospore. The oospore divides and redivides to form the embryo. However, with the development of green leaf and root and with the decay of prothallus, sporophyte develops into an independent plant body.